today we'd like to focus on new people, the blood DNA virome in 8,000 humans that, that was published in PLOS Pathogens in 2017. Hi, Aria. Hi, Professor. <laughs> Could you explain the highlight of this paper? So, um, this paper is led by um, Ahmed Mustafa from uh, Human Longevity by Craig Venter. In this interesting paper, the authors try to characterize the common cell uh, community of viruses that are res resident in the human blood. So the main contribution of uh, the authors in this paper is to provide um, a reference set for all the viruses that are present in healthy individuals, which show no, sim no, no symptoms and they don't have any kind of uh, infections. So future studies that aim to characterize or identify novel viruses should be able to use this set of viruses that those authors contributed in order to benchmark their studies against them. Do you think this technology can be utilized utilized for medical application in the future? Yeah, so so this, this paper is of direct relevance um, initially for uh, transfusion of blood because um, normally any patient or any person who is admitted to any kind of hospital or who, or who wishes to make any kind of uh, normal laboratory tests, they have to be tested against a set of um, viruses that are potentially pathogenic or can be um, transmitted or transfused through blood transfusions. So by making the systematic characterization of all the normal uh, viruses that are already present in the human blood, uh, yeah, of course, this paper helps a lot. Very interesting. Thank you so much, Aliyah. <laughs>